What's up guys, a few hours ago we just got a new Resident Evil 8 trailer and I watched the live stream with my friends earlier but now I want to react to the trailer with you guys. I haven't seen the trailer ever since but now I'm going to react to it in full detail right now. Alright, here we go. In 3, 2, 1... Hey now, think positively, alright? Me! We talked about this. I know. So it looks like Hard Ian else. had a baby with her. Amy, Ian, Ethan. <laughs> Ian. <laughs> oh man, this is. This is gonna be something else, dude. I don't want to go in there, dude. It's so Resident Evil 1, man. Mother Miranda, I regret to inform you that Yo, this lady, man, escaped. If I didn't have a girlfriend. Because he is in my castle. You know what I'm talking about. Too much for my daughters to handle. When I find him. No, Mother Miranda. So this is Ethan's yes, point of view. He's just I looking at her. How she not know I'm there? I won't let you down. Oh, this is so Resident Evil 1, man. And someone I recently know. played Resident what Evil 1 like is going three on? weeks ago. No. I loved it. The place is full of nothing but blood and death. Oh, we're playing through the whole series right now. I'm on five at the moment. Creepy man. I didn't get a good look at them before. They got swords. I didn't notice the swords. Ooh, she's so eerie. Let's eat this baby. What did they need the baby for? Wow. That lady's wow. huge. Ethan Winters. There you are. <laughs> oh. Eight village. <laughs> so funny how they do the title. This is gonna be crazy, dude. I cannot wait for this. Who the fuck are you? Let's see this guy. It's gonna be levitating <laughs> stuff. How is how is Ethan gonna be a match with this guy? <laughs> May 7th, 2021. Oh, I cannot wait for this, dude. Oh, it, this game is one of my most anticipated games of the year. I still haven't finished playing all of them yet. I've played one, two, three, four, and now I'm on five, like midway through it. I just need six and seven, but I'm super excited for this. That was a great trailer and all, but right after the showcase, they dropped the trailer called Maiden. And it basically puts you in the place, that little castle that Ethan's going to go to in the game. But it's a different time period and it has nothing tied into the game. Uh, doesn't have any story beats tied in. But it's still pretty cool. And so I downloaded it and it's crazy. I loved it from the moment I got in. It was really dark the entire time. So eerie. It has the... The PlayStation 5, the dual sense technology integrated so you can feel haptics and stuff like that. It's like, it was all right. But the 3D audio and the headsets is insane. That part was crazy. I'm over here, like one ear, I'm hearing like the whistling of a pot on the stove. The other ear, I'm hearing somebody like getting murdered. Like it's crazy and it's really immersive. Like I was actually really surprised because I've been waiting for this game for a while and I really wanted to know how are they going to step it up? And they really stepped it up. The visuals in the demo were insane. I can't wait to see it in the full game. But it looked, it was a beautiful game. Frames never dropped for me. We, we were, um, me and my buddies were like, man, is this going to be 60 frames? I don't know yet, but hopefully because some of the movement and stuff like that, it's kind of slow. So I would like to, it to be nice and smooth instead of just the frames dropping every once in a while. But I think it's going to be fine. I think just the scenery, the darkness, the lighting, the detail, the attention to detail, which is what they mentioned in the live stream. And it was true. I, I literally looked at everything and I was like, this is the most detailed chair I think I've seen in a video game. And I think their promises are being kept. They wanted to step it up from seven and just evolve what they did. And they are definitely doing that. And dude, 
in the demo, which is like 15 minutes by the way, but it feels so long because you're literally just walking and it's so creepy. I'm turning around like every moment in the demo. I just turned around right now, that was weird. <laughs> but anyways, there's the dopest, this is gonna sound weird. This is the coolest hanging body that I've ever seen ever. <laughs> well, in a video game sense. And I don't like seeing dead people. That's weird. I don't like seeing that. But it's a video game. And I think it's the coolest image of a dead body hanging. Play the demo. I'm going to show you. I don't want to ruin it. But you play the demo. You'll see what I'm talking about. It was the creepiest thing. And I think it was just cool because it looked so distra- it looked It looked way too real. But I enjoyed the, realist- ugh, the realism about it. Well, those are my thoughts about the new Resident Evil trailer and the Resident Evil demo. I hope you really enjoyed it. I am super hyped for this game. May is right around the corner. I cannot wait to get my hands on this game. I will definitely be reviewing the game for you guys. At the moment, I am playing Hitman 3, so that review will be out soon. But if you like this, like, comment, subscribe, and bend on.